As a scout, you'll probably many a time lost your woggle, so your knacker is uh, flapping around in the breeze. And uh, what I'm going to do today is to show you how to tie a friendship knot. Friendship knot is so called because the two ends of your knacker are friends with each other. Although it's also a knot that we often get somebody else to tie for us, uh, a friend, and uh, we'll do that. So what you do is you take one end, pass it across the other, so it's on top, and take that part underneath and back. So you've effectively, you've created a loop underneath that part. And once we've done that, we then take this one, pass that over, that through the loop there, back through, and then tidy it up. And that is all there is to it. It's a fairly simple knot, but it's uh, fastened your neck together. So I'll do that again. What I'll do is I'll, I'll undo that and I'll uh, put the, uh, the camera in even closer so you can uh, see perhaps a little bit more clearly. So what I've done, that one over there, underneath and then pulled it back. So you can see that this one here comes right the way through and this one goes underneath and then loops back. So then this, holding that so it doesn't come undone, take this part, pass it up through the center there and if you've got a loop here that you will have created. So you're pushing it through that loop can be a bit fiddly depending on your and if you've got edging on your your uh, stripes on your edge of your necker then it, it certainly is, is a little more difficult because they don't want to fold and then just gently tease the the sides to pull it like that and if you look there you'll see that that is a square and there we have it a square knot so hopefully we'll now see uh, less of you with your, your neck flapping around when you've lost your woggles, you better do those.